Dear partners and fans, we would like to share with you the improvements we have been doing on the suspensions on our trucks. As you can see, the front spring is uh, much more efficient than the last years, especially uh, extreme bumps, high speed bumps. We can take at least 30 km faster than in the year 2020. So our focus was mainly on the front and rear suspension together with our strong partner. Hendrickson on the leaf spring side and in relation to Reiger on the shock and uh, coil spring, we made a huge uh, progress. We would also like to share with you the future innovations of MKR technology. So Mario, take it over. Hello partners. Normally you always see us around a complete finished truck and we show, us, uh, show you nice things, let's say, with details around. Today we make it a bit different. I just show you a naked chassis ready to be produced the first full electrical truck from MKR. It needs a lot more than just put an electromotor and a battery in. So we have to start really from the ground, from the base, because the really key point to have a benefit out of an electrical vehicle is to reduce the total vehicle weight. And of course, you have to say to take everything in consideration to really each screw, each hole, each fixation must be even more compact and more think about, think through about it, uh, that you reach it. One of the key points is also the suspension work. Today, all of us running uh, steel springs, except uh, the hybrid truck, they are running already since two years the hybrid spring, it means the main leaf, it's still the steel uh, spring and the support leaf, it's the compensate material which it's showing here. And just that you get an idea because everybody thinks like ah, yeah, compensate, uh, fiber class and things. This spring have three times the lifetime than a steel spring. I just can give you an example, the steel spring we change after heat a uh, half Dakar, let's say. If we run at six or seven stages, it's a risk to get tired and break. And this one, it's the same spring since two years and never touched and never broken and never get some showness that is getting tired. So this going to be, uh, this, sorry, this we are running already since two years and we are really, really satisfied. The big advantage this have 12 kilo and a steel spring have 55 kilo. The next step, the next generation, which is going to be tested together with our strong partner Hendrickson, it's a full compensate spring. It means, as you see, the connection points here. This is the next step, what we are going to test in the ve electric vehicle and probably in the hybrid after Dakar and see, but I'm really convinced with our strong partner that we will succeed and that's the key point also to reduce more than 100 kilo anti-spring mass and more than 100 kilo in general vehicle weight. This gives us again an opportunity to put more batteries or other things for cooling because the electric vehicle also needs to be having a higher cooling than any other vehicle. And there you see now, for example, also on the chassis side, if you go a bit back, that's just the base now. It's based on the chassis 2019, but also there will be a lot of weight reduced during the next two, three months. And our target is until middle of next year to have the first try with the new truck. And if you want to see more innovations, then follow us on Facebook and Instagram. And for now, wish us good luck at Dakar 2022.